Good morning, everybody. This morning we're going to read Finding Wild, written by Megan Wagner Lloyd. <laughs> what is wild? And where can you find it? Wild is tiny and fragile and sweet baby new. It pushes through cracks and crannies and steals back forgotten places. Sometimes wild is so tricky you have to squint to see it. And then there are times you can't possibly miss it. Wild creeps and crawls and slithers. It leaps and pounces and shows its teeth. Wild is full of smells. Fresh mint, ancient cave, sun-baked desert, sharp pine, salt sea. Every scent begging you to drink it in. Wild is forest fire hot and icicle cold. It's as smooth as the petals of poppies and as rough as the fierce face of a mountain. Wild can hurt. Watch out, itch, burn, ouch, sting. But wild can also soothe. Gentle breeze, cheering sun, soft rain. The wild keeps many secrets waiting to be discovered, like its candy, honey from the bees, sap from the trees, swift melting snowflakes, and juice bursting blackberries. Wild roars and barks and hisses and brays, its storm thunders and wind whispers. Wild sings. Sometimes wild is buried too deep, and it seems like the whole world is clean and paved, ordered and tidy. You look around and look again, and all you can see are streets and cars and buildings so high they hide the sky. And then, just when you were about to give up, there. There it is again, old and worn, still standing strong. Wild. The